A new bill in South Carolina could change the way you raise your kids. Under the so-called free range parenting bill, moms and dads wouldn't be charged with neglect if their child is found alone, playing outside, walking home from school, or walking the dog. And as you can imagine, this proposal is pretty controversial among parents. NBC Charlotte, Savannah Levins joins us live. Savannah? Yeah, Fred, you know, it really is. Some parents think they should be able to let their children go to the park, for instance, by themselves, and it shouldn't be a big deal, right? But plenty of other parents say in the world that we live in today, kids just need adult supervision. The controversy over so-called free-range parents dates back several years. In 2014, a South Carolina mom was charged with a felony for letting her nine-year-old play at a park while she worked at the nearby McDonald's. In 2015, Danielle and Alexander Mady of Maryland were charged with neglect for letting their 10- and 6-year-old kids walk alone to and from a local park. We're amazed that this has become a national conversation because we're just doing what our parents did, what was considered perfectly normal just one generation ago. And most recently in 2018, an Illinois mom was investigated by child services because she let her eight year old take the dog out for a walk. I wanted her to start learning responsibilities. She was gone for about five minutes. And the next thing I know, the police are at the door. Last year, Utah became the first state to pass a bill in favor of free range parents, saying kids that were well cared for can go to school, the playground, or stay in the car alone. Now some South Carolina legislators hoping to pass a similar law. A Senate bill just introduced seeks to lighten up the definition of child neglect, saying parents should be allowed to let their children of, quote, sufficient age and maturity do certain things alone, including walking to and from school, playing outside, staying in a car alone, or staying home unattended. Of course, as long as the child's healthy and taken care of. The court of public opinion is still divided as legislators in South Carolina decide how much freedom and how much required supervision is too much. Parents can make decisions about when their children are old enough to be alone. That bill was just introduced in the state Senate yesterday and is now in committee. Should be interesting to see how that pans up. We'll keep you updated. Reporting live in Uptown, Savannah Levins, NBC Charlotte. Savannah.